Welcome along to another edition of Dr. John's Diaries. Today, we're here at Our Lady Quinnipi School. They have their annual sports day on. It's a part one and two of this uh, show. So join us inside when we meet some of the children enjoying the national sports day. <laughs> What's your name? Edmund. And what are you doing in the sports day today? I'm racing. Are you good at racing? Yeah. Uh, are you very fast? Yeah. All right. And what's your name? Jason. Where are you from, Jason? Crew Park. Are you enjoying the sports day today? Yeah. And what's all your names here? What's your name? Sarah. Uh, Sarah what? Sarah Darty. What class are you going to? You've gone very shy, are you? Are you running today? Are you all running or are you taking part in other sports? I'm running. You're running, are you? Yeah. yeah. What race are you running in? Uh, uh, the bean, the bean, bean bag one. one. Yeah. All right. Have you won any medals in racing before? Yeah. Yeah. What's your name? Jason O'Sullivan. And where are you from? Uh, Mary Ever, Rockford Road. All right. And are you all racing as well today? Yeah. What's your name? Evan. And what's your name? Debbie. Debbie. Where are you from, Debbie? Perfect. And where are we, what's your name? Jim. Jim. What are you taking part in today? Bean bags. You like the bean, what do you do with a bean bag race? Between your legs. Uh, uh, and you walk. Oh, you put the bag between your legs and walk down long? Yeah. And whoever wins, um, to get a medal. You get medals as well? Yeah. Is it, is it better? Oh, at the end of it. At the end of it you get a medal. Yeah. Is it better than going to school, yeah. is it? Yeah. Yeah. Whoever gets there first wins the middle. Yeah, it does. Because first, second, and third. There's only one winner, though, is it in each race? No, three. Three. three winners in each race. Yeah. Yeah. Um, first, the the first wins the middle and wins the prize. All right, off you go, son. Enjoy the race. We'll see you later. Yeah. Take, care, take care of yourselves. What? My teacher said you're putting us on the telly. Yeah, you'll be on the telly. Oh, you're looking well. What team is that? What teams do you support, all of you? Man United. Man United. You're all Man United. You're all Man United. What about the girls? Do you support the soccer team? Yeah. What team? No, it's only all Man United. And Newcastle. Get that one there. That's Newcastle. You're the only Newcastle supporter, are you? I got my two out. I got my two out. Enjoy the day. Well, we're here outside in the grounds of Our Lady Quinnipiac School. As you can see, it's a great, exciting day. They're all here preparing for the National Sports Day. All the classes are taking part, including the parents. There'll be a parents' race later. So we're going to mingle through the crowd and take up some of the excitement here at National Sports Day, which is now compulsory in all schools across the country. All schools have to have one National Sports Day. And we've arrived today to enjoy some of the excitement here. We'll ramble down and meet some of the, the, uh, the children involved and the parents. Just to remind you now, the children here are doing soccer skills and uh, Father Joe Young organised this spot. We're going to watch the kids as they do their soccer skills in just a couple of moments. What's your name? Brady Kiss. I was in the science project. Were you? And what class are you in? Third class. Are you, are you good at school? Yeah. What, what's your favourite subject now? Um, butterflies. No. Are you running today or what are you doing? Uh, we're doing the three-legged race. Three-legged three race? Yeah. And have you got a partner got already? Yeah, Caroline. Caroline, she's going to run with you? Yeah. Uh, are you, do you prefer to be out at the sports day rather than at school? In the sports day. Better than sitting down at class? Yeah. All right. All right. Off you go and enjoy the race. Bye now. See ya. Have a good day. We're here at the sports, as you can see, and we're all enjoying ourselves. Some of the parents are here. What's your name? Carol Walsh. And how many children have you in the school? Two. One. 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 You're hoping for a second one, are you? I will. <laughs> Next year. Next year. What's, he, what's your name? 
What's up your name? What's your name? He's hiding. Shane, What's it? He's Shane. Shane. He'll be starting next year, is he? Hopefully. No, and do you come down to the sports day every year? Every year. Do you take part yourself? No. There, there is a, a, a parents race, I think, later on, is there? Hopefully not. Oh, there is. <laughs> I can tell you now, so you'll be prepared for it. Take part. You'd never know. You look, we might win a medal. I might. Never know. Enjoy the rest of the day here. How about yourself? Are you taking part today in the prime race? No. We'll have to organise a prime race. Is that your own baby? It is, yeah. Well, that, that baby, is it a boy or a girl? girl? It's a girl. I can see the pink. What's her name? Chloe. Um, will she be um, coming to the school here? Hopefully. We'll have, to, have you somebody here racing today? Uh, Natalie. Natalie Dillon. Oh, I know Natalie. Yeah, I met her the last time we were up here. Yeah. What, you, what race is she taking part in? Um, she's in first class. I don't know what race it is. We'll just have to wait and see. Wait and Are see. you going to take part in the parents' race, stuff? Well, if she wants me to, I'll have to. Oh, you'll have to take part and run with the pram. We'll organise a pram race. All right, well, with some of the, the smaller babies, take a look over here, running around the place. Get them in there as well, enjoying themselves. It's a fabulous day. It's all reload TV. Isn't it great? And they're blessed with the weather this morning. Now we have two more girls here from the school enjoying the uh, national sports day today. What's your name? Sarah Mesh. And where are you from, Sarah? Like 25, I don't know where I've been no. from. And what's your friend's name? Turn around this way to the camera. What's Natalie. your name? Natalie. No, are you a big fan of South Park? Yeah. Who's your favourite character in it? Um, Kenny. Kelly. Kenny. Kenny. Right, are you two best buddies here? Um, we're just friends, like. Right? And you, you go around everywhere together, do you? Yeah. Do you go to school together every morning? No. Now, what are you taking part in at the uh, sports day today? We're doing the two-legged race and we're just racing. The two of you are going to run a two-legged race together? Your partners, no? no? And you're best of friends, but you're going away and got partners for some other race? No, she's in first and I'm in third. Oh, so you have to stick to your own class for it, mates, is it? Yeah. Alright, what time is the race on, do you know? I don't know. You're just waiting for them to take part? Yeah. Alright, enjoy the rest of the day. Go off there and enjoy. Come up girls, come over to me. What? We have a small lad here. What's your name? Gone shy. What's his name? Eric. And what's your name? Katrin. And wh are you in the school races today? Yes. What class are you in? Third. Tell us what goes on in third class now. Um, we do art and we we do our we write and we do sums and we do all different kind of things PE. And what do you think of a, a sports day getting a day off school to come out and run around the fields? I think it's great. Do you enjoy it? Yeah. Right. Well, who's your favourite music now? Who do you like to listen to? Spice Girls. Are you going to say, remain a loyal fan even though there's only four of them left? Yeah. All right. Enjoy the rest of the day. Is this your brother? Yeah. And you're just keeping an eye on him, is it? Yeah. Does he, uh, is he taking part in the races today? He don't, he won't race today. Oh, won't he? All right, enjoy the stuff. Come over, girls. Who didn't I get? This girl's here. <laughs> Two of you. Now, what's your name? Lorna. Oh, turn over this way, Lorna. Don't oh, come around this way. And um, where are you from? Jamesborough, 22. Then you have an enemy, Jamesborough. And what class are you in? First class. Do you enjoy the school? Yeah. What's your favourite thing in school? Reading. What do you like to read now? Your school books. Do you read at home a lot? Yeah. And what's your favourite books at home? What do you read at home now? I don't know. Comics and whatever. Yeah. Okay, what's your name? Jane. I'm over here. And where are you from, Jane? James, bro. And what do you like at school? Um, PE. No, are you taking part in the races today? Yeah. What, what race will you be doing? Running. And I don't know what it is. Have you won any medals in sports yet? I only won one soccer. And well, soccer here at the school day, is it? CBS. Oh, you play soccer for the CBS as well, do you? No, yeah. We play against them. Oh, did you? And you won medals? Yeah. yeah. What, what class was that now? Uh, second, I think, or first. Second. 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 Just turn around there where you can get you on the camera. And you, each of you won a medal? Yeah. And where are the medals now? They're at home. Have you got them in a big glass cabinet so everybody can see them? Not really. Just no. to keep them away. Yeah. Are you hoping for a medal today? Yeah. yeah. All right. Who's the fastest in your class, do you think? Sarah. She's second. Third. Fourth. Oh, I can win you. Oh, well, you can beat her, can you? Yeah. No, oh, I can beat her. No, you can beat She can beat you. All right. We're going to see you later. Yeah. And we'll be watching it. See you later on. So enjoy the rest of the day. Now, we have a lady, and it seems to be the only one that managed to get a seat. How did you get a seat today? Well, I got a seat because of a broken leg, John. What happened? You fell down a hole or something? I fell down a hole in the lady's house, yeah. 
No, and the arch is broken, the is it? The arch of the foot is broke, but I got the plaster off yesterday, so... But that's a good excuse now for no more uh, homework, or homeworks as I, housework for a while. You can take a break. Well, I never really liked housework anyway, John, to be No, honest. obviously, there's no point in asking you, are you racing today? I'm definitely not racing anyway. You could I'm do the piggyback I could, race. I could, with my crutches, I suppose. We need a volunteer to carry her in the piggyback <laughs> race. Somebody could carry her. So who have you today in the, in the uh, school crazy. race? See. Stacey, my daughter, she's in Miss Maloney's class. Is she running today or she what? Is. Is she a good runner? She's a great runner. She's a great singer. She's brilliant at everything. Yeah, we have her on already. <laughs> she sang a song for us already. We have that. That's right, yeah. So you're going to sit back now and relax for the day? Yeah, relax and watch her. And I'm all excited and I hope she wins. And if she and doesn't, there'll be war in the, <laughs> in the field. And we hope you'll take part in the piggyback race, which is coming up shortly. Like it up in your back, so <laughs> you're not the only one. There's a lot of people been getting up on my back for years. What's your name? Mrs. Kate and Catherine's mother. Oh, you're down to, to keep an eye on her. Oh, keep an eye on her. Give her a helping hand if I can. Will you be taking part in the oh, grandparents' I race? I don't think so. Just thought of that one. That was a good one, isn't it? That was a great. There should one. be a grandparents' race, isn't there? Yeah, maybe there will be. So. Wouldn't she get up on your back now? I mean, she's been on your back for years. So another oh, day wouldn't make, down, wouldn't make a difference. Kevin said it's down there. I could get up on his back, all right. He's down there, the blondy haired fella. Yeah. I'm Keegan, you know Kevin. Kevin Keegan, yeah. yeah, I know him. I met him coming in there a while ago. So are you enjoying the day today? Lovely, it's and, beautiful. And the lucky with the weather. Very, very lucky. Isn't it a great yeah. thing, rather, that when we... Do you remember going to school uh, a sports day, a national sports day? I do, of course, yeah. I don't remember it all. We never had it. Did you? No, I don't remember it all. So when you went to school, you, you had a... Do you remember running with the spoon and the... I do, but I don't remember like having a day off at school. Oh, no, no, they wouldn't give you a day off now at That's all. That's what I'm saying. We never all got right. days off. Yeah. Bank no, holidays, no. church holidays, school holidays. They're getting great time off. They have more time off now than You never saw a spoon race? Race? No. Never said oh, you're joking one. me. No, what do you do? You don't know what a spoon race is. I don't. <laughs> She's having us on. And, and the, the three-legged race where you're, oh, yeah, in the bay. you know. Yeah, yeah but the yeah, spoon race, right, you get an egg, an egg. a hard-boiled egg. A hard-boiled egg. Hard yeah, you put it on a large tablespoon. Right. And you run with it. And the person to get to the end first with the egg unbroken. Wins. Yeah, and if the egg Trap falls off, you go back. Broke. If it is hard. <laughs> yeah, all right. Break, Stick with it, will you? Stay with me on this one. <laughs> Just stay with me. Try and I know the foot is affecting you. But try and stay alive in this one. Uh, but that's the general idea. The first person to get to the end with the egg, uncracked. Uncracked. Should I say okay. that? Would and that's how the book. You genuinely never saw a spoon rest. No, like, never, never. God, she's had a sheltered life. <laughs> you kept her, kept it. Enjoy the rest of the day, lad. Thanks very much. Now we're enjoying the sports day here at Our Lady Quinnipiac School. What's your own name? Mrs. O'Brien. Mrs. O'Brien, who have you got here in the sports today? My granddaughter and my daughter. And are they looking forward to the races? Uh, yes, she's just after finishing. How did you get on the race? I found very well. What, what's your own name? That's me. Danielle. Danielle, how did you get on in the race, Danielle? Fine. Did you win? No. Did you come second? Last. You came last. <laughs> well, that's still, as, at least you took part in the race. Are you going to go for, look forward to next year now and go faster? Yeah. You have to train during the year, you see. The faster you go. Yeah. Well, who do you want to say hello to today? What's all your friends' names? Tell me your friends' names. Shani, Kira, Jessica, and... What's your teacher's name? Lily Marie. And are they all in the, the, the junior cert class, is it, or the babies? Yeah, babies. The, the, the ba early starters. Early start. Yeah. They're all inside there. Yeah. How many have you gone through the school? I have eight. Eight? Yes. Over the years? Yeah, and have the granddaughter. I have two grandsons as well coming here. All right. Um, Enjoy the rest. Are you not going to take part in the parents' rest, no? no we can't. You look very fit. <laughs> after, after 55 years, go away. <laughs> You're 55, you, don't, you, you look about 36. Thank you very much. <laughs> if you don't believe me. Right, there's a race about to start, so we're going to take one of those. At this point, we'll take a little break on Dr. John's diary for the National Sports Day here at the school. Join us for one of the races in part two. Hi, what's your name? Ma. And tell us, did you win a race today? Yeah. Now, how old are you? Four. And what class are you in? 
Mr. Lawn is class. And uh, what are you going to get? Do you, when you won the race, did you come first, second or third? First. So that means you're going to get? A prize. A big medal. And where are you, where are you going to wear the medal? Here. Uh, was it a hard race to run? Yeah, it was a very hard one. Did you go your fastest? Yes. Yeah. You did. All right, well done to you now. What's your name? Shane. James. Shane. Shane. And what did you win? You came third in the race. Yeah. You're going to get a medal now as well, are you? What certificate you're getting? Yeah. All right. Uh, did you run very fast? He caught up with me, but he, but he got on top of me. He got on top of you. You slow down a bit, did you? You go faster now for next year. Yeah. Okay. And over here, did you come second? Yes. In the same race? You all ran in the same race? Yes. What's your name? I'm Lee Summers. Where are you from, Lee? Um, Keys Park. I bet you're a big fan of Eric Cantona, are you? The boy guy. Yeah. So would you go? Oh, you're all Manchester United, gang. No, I'm Liverpool. Liverpool. You're Liverpool? Yeah. You go for Man United. I go for Man United. And you you got a cert as well, did you? Yes. Are you taking part in more races today? Yes. All right, enjoy the rest of the day in the sunshine. <laughs> With me here now are the girls' race that took part. What is, what's your name? Anna. Nicole. Kelly. No, and what race did you take part in? The under? Did what age are you? Five. So it was the under five race, was it? Yeah. No, who, who's your teacher? Miss Baloney. Miss Baloney. Who's your teacher? Is she a good teacher? You came first today. Was it a very hard race out there? No. Did you enjoy running? Are you taking part in more races today? Are you going to get involved with the piggyback race? And the egg and spoon? Alright. And what's your surname now? Nicole. And where are you from? Crew Park. Right. Are you taking part in more races today? Yeah. Turn around this way now, the camera sees you. And are you going to put your certificate up in the wall when you get it? Yeah. Uh, will you bring it around to all your friends? Okay, and you came toward. You're getting a certificate as well, are you? And what are you going to do with your certificate? Hang it on my wall. And show it to all your friends. Yeah. You'll be very proud of it. All right, well done. Are you off to race again out today? Yeah. All right, off you go and enjoy the day, okay? Yeah. They're just some of the winners, the girls race under fives, and uh, first, second and third. Have a great day at the races. <laughs> Right, with me here at the sports day, what's your name? Caroline. And uh, what's your surname? It's Gerald. Where are you from? Coo Park. What class are you in now? Tours. You're very shy, are you? Yeah. Right, are you taking part in the races today? Yep. What races will you run in? I think it's a three-legged race. Have you done it before? No. Have you, do you take part normally in sports yourself? Not really. You just enjoyed the day out today? It's better than sitting in the classroom, is it? Yeah. No. Um, have you won any medals before in the sports day? No. No, you're hoping for your best today? Yeah. Right. Who's your favourite friend? Who's your best pal in school? Is that, is that not great to ask you? It's not a great question, is it? In case uh, there's a few of them around. Have you a few best friends? You have none? No best friends at all? Oh, you're all best friends. No, what's your name? Come over to me. Carrie. <laughs> you stood behind me. What's your What's your name? Carrie. What class are you in? Fifth. And what are you doing today now? Um, the fun race and the one-legged race. Have you won any um, prizes in them before? I don't know. I can't remember. I can't remember. All right, off you go on the race today. Now, where's the girl with all those hula hoops? What's your name? Yes, you got it. Come over here. Come over and tell me about the hoops. What are the hoops for? We got, we put your ball in the circle and we put yours around us. You you put a ball, you put them in the ground, is it? Yeah. yeah. We have to put them over our heads. 
What are you turn around here and tell me about the, the hoops. Cool. You put them on the ground. Yeah, can we have a fun race? Yeah. And are you very good at it? Yeah. Who's the best at it? Me. Alright, what's your name? Sandra. Alright, okay, enjoy the races. Enjoy them. No, what's your name? Rachel. Rachel? She here. And where are you from? Uh, kind of like two houses because my nana has like no. bread and breakfast. What's your favourite um, sport? Do you take part in sports a lot? Yeah. What's your favourite sport? Soccer. And who, who, what club do you support? Pardon? What club do you support? Manchester United. Are you, are you all into Manchester United? Yeah. Any Liverpool supporters here? No. no? Are you running today or are you doing uh, piggyback racing or what? Um, the same thing, fun racing and racing. You're all running. What's your name? Michelle Berry. Where are you from, Michelle? Jensburg. No. What's your favourite sport? What do you like to do? Running. Are you? Have you won any medals yet? No. For second and third, well, I'm winning. And have you involved with any of the uh, running clubs in town, no? No. Any sports clubs, no? no. She's my friend. Hello. Okay, what's your name? Olivia. <laughs> Where are you from, Olivia? James Road. And uh, what do you do in your hobbies when you're outside of school? Swim. Where do you swim? Um, Enders. Oh, just up there. Is it very good, Enders? Is it the best of the pools? Yeah. yeah. And do you go to any other swimming pools? Sometimes rocks go fast. How, how fast can you swim? How many strokes can you do? I don't know. Like just like swimming. Yeah. And what channel are you on? Oralo TV. All right, let's go over here. What's your name? I caught you. I didn't win. What's your name? Dennis. Did you have a race already? No, not yet. Are you running later on today? After your first class. Yeah, and what, what races are you running in? What, what age group will you be? Second. Oh, the beanbag. Now tell us a bit about that beanbag again. You put it through your legs and you run. Have you run very fast with it? Yeah. Uh, who do you want to say hello to today as we're here? My uncle. Now, who's all your small friends? What's your name? Cousin and cousin. What's her name? She already won. Did she? Did you win the race? Yeah. What's her name? Kelly. How old is she? Four and a half. And are you looking forward to your fifth birthday? You are? Yeah. What do you do on your birthday? Play my toys. Do you get loads of presents? Yeah. And does any of you know a song? Do you sing any songs? No. Do you know the Barney song? No. You don't? No, get her. What's your name? Shauna. Shauna. Did you win any races yet? Look up there, Luis. Look up to the camera. Show your face to the camera there. You didn't win any race yet, no? No. Are you going in for races? Is she going into the race? She already um, did it. She didn't yeah. win anything yet. Ask her next time, okay? Lovely tracksuit. No, let's get this girl here. Come over to me. What's your name? Elita. Lolita? No, Elisa. Oh, Elisa, I thought it was Lolita. What class are you in? Third. <laughs> Third. Is it? Now, what are sports events are you taking play, part in today? Um, um, we're going to be doing the two-legged race. Who's your friend in the two-legged race? Emma. All right. Is she good? Is she fast now? Yeah. Have you practiced this? Kind of. Today only. Oh, yeah, you have to wait for the... You see the program last night about the Navy in the submarines? Yes. Did you watch it last night? It's a very small area to stick in for three months every... For, it's a long time, isn't it? Yes. Well, no, let's get a few more faces here. What's your name? Bridget Quinlivan. Where are you from? I'm Sigmar Avenue, Rafa. No. What did you take part in, in the races today? No, I didn't take part in that yet. Um, I'm in the two-legged race. And who's your partner on that? Uh, Lisa McInerney. Is she fast? Yes. All right. What's your hobbies outside of school? Hurling and rugby. Who do you play hurling for? Um, all Christians. How did you get involved with hurling? Um, I just I walked up and I started to play. And you joined up. Is it a tough sport, hurling? Yes. But you enjoy it? Yeah. You have to wear helmets now, you do? Yes. You don't play camogie at all, no? No. All right. Let's get a few more. Come over here. Come over here a minute now. Stand around there till I get the camera. What's your name? Emma Whelan. Where are you from, Emma? I am born in your arm. Aspect like. Now, did you take part in the sports? No, not yet. We're doing we're doing the ordinary race. And we're doing the three-legged race. And what's your favourite uh, race? Uh, the straight race. Just over there a minute now to make sure. The straight race. Now, who do you want to say hello to today? 
uh, my nana and my friend Elisa and everyone else, everyone who knows me. Do you think is Our Lady Quinnipiac a great school to be involved in? You have a great crack here. Well, we hope you've enjoyed part one of our day trip here for the National Sports Day at Our Lady Quinnipiac School here in Janesborough. Join us next week for part two and we continue the story of the National Sports Day. Remember, RLO TV, Dr. John's Diaries. If you have something happening in your area, get in touch with us. Write to us at Dr. John's Diaries, RLO TV, Norwich House, 17 Patrick Street, Limerick. Or phone us at 061 31 95 95. Leave your name and telephone number and we'll get back to you.